Hi everyone, how are you doing? This is Kaylana and thank you for stopping by my YouTube channel, The Blessed Driver. Today, I'm going to give you guys a nice tutorial on the company called Ship Day. I'm gonna show you guys a, a, a 10 to maybe 12 minute tutorial on how the Ship Day app and website works. Now, if you guys wanna know a little bit about Ship Day, I'm gonna get into that in just a moment, but I would like to give a shout out and a thank you to Ship Day for sponsoring this video. Now, Ship Day is a free and easy to use and local delivery management software. They offer efficient dispatch systems and live delivery tracking with ETA. For those that are in the restaurant delivery, meal prep delivery, grocery delivery, and other local delivery services, they offer this service around the world. ShipDay was born from a desire to help small businesses maximize the power of local deliveries to help their businesses grow. Their team's mission is to democratize delivery dispatch and tracking technology for small businesses and aspiring entrepreneurs, and to also spur growth in local economies across the globe. And so I'm very excited to have been able to partner with ShipDay because there are a lot of companies out there that are starting, especially in startups that are starting up right now and they offer uh, delivery services. And so some of you guys have uh, maybe ordered, you know, from a restaurant or even grocery delivery and not realizing that you're utilizing ShipDay's platform. So for those of you guys who have a company or a small business or even a potential large business that will utilize a delivery system, I would highly suggest that you guys use ShipDay. Day. So now I'm going to show you guys a nice tutorial on how the ShipDay website and app works. Welcome to ShipDay. We are so glad you are here. We really make managing deliveries easy for local businesses like restaurant delivery, meal prep delivery, grocery delivery, and other courier services. Our easy to use software and mobile app helps you easily dispatch deliveries to drivers. You can monitor the progress in real time on our dashboard and share live tracking with your customers. Once you assign orders to drivers, they can see everything on the driver app. They can contact customers and navigate on the road using GPS. Customers receive text notifications with live order tracking. It shows expected delivery time and the live location of the driver. You can easily connect your online store or ordering website with ShipDay with APIs and integration apps. Now that you know the basics, feel free to get started. Welcome to your new ShipDay account. We are happy to have you here. I know the dashboard can look confusing at first, but I promise it's easier to use than you think. In this video, I'll be giving you a demo of all of the important first steps to help you understand how to use ShipDay with your own business. If you only have a quick question regarding drivers, orders, or settings, check out the rest of our videos. We have a bunch of short how-to videos that might help you. Once you are logged into your account, you will be on the dispatch screen. This will be empty for you because you haven't added any drivers or orders yet. So first things first, let's add a new driver. If you navigate over to the driver tab, you will see this green new driver button. Once you click this, a box will pop up with a couple of things to fill out. You'll need a name, phone number, email, and temporary password. This temporary password will be sent to your new driver alongside a link to download our driver app. I will be showing you the driver app and how it works a little later in this video, but for now, let's stay on the dashboard. Congratulations, you've created your first driver. See how easy that was? You can do this for as many drivers as you have, and it's the same process every time. Now that we have a driver, it's time to create an order. If you go over to the orders tab, you'll see a new order button on the right side. It's very similar to how you just created a driver, but we're inputting other information. Once you click on this button, a box will pop up and you'll be able to put in a bunch of order information. You'll first put a order number. This can be anything you want, but I'm going to put one because this is our first order. Then you'll input your business's information, followed by your customers. On the right hand side, you'll input the order details, Let's say my customer wants a burger and a soda. I'll put that here and then keep moving down. 
If you have any tax, delivery fee, or tips you need to add, you'll put them in here. And then you'll fill out a delivery instruction if you have any. This would be something like leaving the package outside the door or anything else the customer has specified. Finally, you'll put the payment method, card or cash. It's pretty self-explanatory. Once you're finished, you'll click save and there you go. You've created your first order. You can make this process easier by using our online order forms. I'm not going to go over this right now, but we do have a separate video about it that you can watch. Simply, you can send your customer an order form through a link and they can fill it out on their end and then it'll automatically show up in your dashboard. Next, I'll introduce the map tab. This is where you will see all of your in-progress orders and drivers. As you can see, we have the order we just made on the map. The little orange bubble is my business, and the red one is the customer. Everything is color-coded and easy to distinguish from each other. And if you click on any of these bubbles, it will pop up with some information. Mainly the address, and the customer will also have an area for driver information. As you can see, there is no driver currently assigned to the order. Let's change that. To dispatch an order to a driver, we first need to make sure that our drivers have downloaded the driver app and logged on. Since you probably don't have any drivers online yet, we can dispatch an order to ourselves to practice. Go on over to the Dispatch tab and you'll see under New Orders, the order we had created. Assigning a driver is easy. All you have to do is click the Assign button and click on whoever you want to give it to. This will send it to the Driver app where your driver can accept or decline the order. Now let's move to the Driver app so we can see this process. Once you are logged in and online, you will see that order that I just sent from my computer. It'll be in the Waiting Orders tab. This is where all incoming orders are that are waiting to be accepted. If we accept this order, it will move to our current order screen. Here, we are able to mark our progress as we pick up and drop off our deliveries. You can also click on the order at any time to see the order details, including the customer's address, what they ordered, and the total. This app is very user-friendly and easy to maneuver. Once you play around with it a couple of times, it should be pretty simple to use. I know it can look intimidating at first, but with all things, once you use it enough, you'll become familiar with it. The driver app also allows you to call the business or customer if needed and navigate to each location using Apple Maps, Google Maps, or any other navigation app. In the top right corner, you can open up the map where you can see your business's location as well as the customer's. It works the same way as on your computer. You can click on the bubbles and the order information will pop up. What's really cool is when you start making progress on the order, your customer will receive a text message with their own tracking link so that they can see where their order is in real time. This happens with every order, allowing the customer to have a part in the process. We have more videos about the driver app if you want a more in-depth explanation of the settings and everything that comes with it. But for now, we are going to head back to the dashboard so we can see what has updated. Back on the dashboard, we can see the updated progress of our order. It has changed from picked up to on the way, as we saw in the driver app. All of our software connects seamlessly to give your business an easy and trusting system to use. I would like to show you how to use one more app that should be helpful when you are on the go and not next to a computer. It's our ShipDay Dispatch app, and it's pretty much identical to the dashboard you see on your laptop. However, we've managed to squeeze it into your iPhone or Android screen. It's easy and free to download as well. Here we are. I want to introduce our ShipDay Dispatch app. Like I said, it is exactly what you see on your computer, but on your phone, so you can easily create drivers and dispatch orders on the go. 
You'll log in with the same email and password you use for your online ship day dashboard and it'll bring you straight to the order screen. We have three different tabs on the main screen, orders, the map, and drivers. It's very similar to what I showed you on the computer. Here we can see that same order that we've been practicing with. I'd love to show you how to create an order from this app. It's super simple. Just go to the plus sign on the top right. It will give you the same information to fill out. An order number, your business's info, your customer's info, and the order total. If you want to add those extra order details, like what the customer actually ordered, you can click add details and another box will pop up for you to fill out. Once you finish filling in all of the information, click confirm order. And just like that, you've created another order. This new order can be seen on the map, just like your first one. You can also add drivers from this app by going to the driver tab and clicking the plus sign in the top right corner. Just fill in the required information and bang, you have another driver. If we go back to the order screen, we can easily dispatch our new order to a driver. If you click the person icon on the right of your order, your drivers will pop up and you can just click on the one you want to assign. It's very easy and helpful when you can't be in front of a computer all day to be able to do this from your phone. Now that you know how to create orders and drivers, how to see them on the map, and how to dispatch these orders to drivers, you should be all set on starting with your ShipDay account. If you have any more specific questions, please don't hesitate to contact our team. I do recommend going through our video list to learn even more about ShipDay and answer any more of your questions. I hope that you guys enjoyed that nice tutorial on how the ship day software system works. I think that this is a great company to start out with and also they offer free features. And so I, I know a lot of these delivery tracking systems are very expensive, but ship day is very inexpensive and also they have free features for you guys to use. So if you are trying to start a grocery delivery business, um, you have a restaurant or if you have a business that just wants um, to use, um, you know, maybe some type of delivery system, I will highly suggest that you guys uh, utilize the ship day platform they are very very friendly as far as the support staff and also they're very professional so if you guys want to sign up there is a link down there in the description box below go ahead and click that link to sign up and also just to play around with the software a little bit so you guys can kind of see how it works if you guys have any questions you're more than welcome to shoot me a comment below or even an email which is in my description box below again if you guys want to sign up for ship day there's a link down there in the description box below you can try the free demo and also just try the software for free I think you guys will like it and there are a lot of free features it doesn't cost much at all or if anything um, if you guys want to use the software for your company so thank you guys for stopping by my YouTube channel I appreciate all of you I have more videos to come on how ship day can offer scalability for your business especially if you are running a delivery type of platform once again this is Kaylana and I'm signing off and thank you for stopping by the blessed driver don't forget to hit that like button share and also hit the notification bell to be notified on any future and upcoming videos God bless you guys bye bye